It's been a dream season for St. Henry, and today the undefeated Redskins can write the storybook ending. Redskins taking on Gates Gilmore Academy in the Division III state finals. St. Henry is seeking its eighth state title in school history, which would tie them with St. Ursula and Newark Catholic for most volleyball titles all time in Ohio. And the entire St. Henry community at the Nutter Center today. White out the theme. First set, skin swinging big. Savannah Worms on the slide, 7-2. Red and Madison Broering. Back sets to Olivia Kneekamp. Big smash leads up to seven. They keep the pressure on. It's Kneekamp again. Off the block and out. Redskins win the first set 25-14. Sets two and three different story. In the third, Julia Roskowski, the middle hit. Gilmore goes up two sets to one. Like all season, there's no quit in this Skins team though. Brittany Seafrain through the block and down 10-7 St. Henry. Then on the other side, Ellie Stammen. Slides it off the block, 18-15 Redskins. Set point now in the fourth. And the Mac player of the year comes up huge. Mac Madison Broering with the block. St. Henry evens the match 2-2. But the fifth belongs to Gilmore match point. Alexa Turk the block and they take it 15-7. St. Henry's perfect season comes to an end 3-2 despite the fight and grit of this senior class. They made their parents proud, they made their coaches proud, and they'll remember this as long as they live. Um, it might have not, like I said, been the outcome that they wanted, um, but they will remember it. You don't just get to the state championship game by a fluke. They, they earned every single point. We're the type of team, no matter what the score is, we're going to keep trying to fight, but Gilmore just had the upper edge on us, and they, didn't, they were relentless and didn't give up. I'm very, very proud of them. They were great leaders. They fought every single day, whether it was practice or in a game. You can never count us out because no, def no deficit was too big for them to overturn. They're winners on the court no matter the outcome today, and they're going to be winners off the court the rest of their lives.